hooked. Uh, you want to start as you as you're dashing in. You want to start shroud of the darkness. Then when you get there, you start uh, unspeakable horror. So you do R W E and then you Q, and by then you already have a um, attack damage and attack speed, and uh, they're gonna die. <laughs> very powerful champion. Very very fun. If you play against uh, Nocturne, uh, nobody plays Nocturne anymore. Very rare. If you play against Nocturne, just uh, good luck. <laughs> if he surprises you, there's no way to avoid him. Good luck. That's all I have to say. All right, no, 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 no. You want a jungle basically with no, no. So you want to start with Q to bite, bite the jungle monsters, it heals you and shit. Uh, Blood Boil is going to give you some attack speed, Ice Blast, you want to buy one Q, then you go Ice Blast and you're going to max Ice Blast, buy some ability power, that E, that E, ah oh, there's another Frost Champion against Lee Sin. Uh, that E will slow people down and chunk half of their life down, uh, does, a thou does over a thousand damage. If you have a lot of ability power, very fun. Absolute Zero is an ult that you need to cast from inside the bush. You need to be hidden to catch the enemy by surprise. Otherwise, uh, you can do a combo uh, EQ, uh, ER. So you can do, uh, if the enemies are inside there, they're going to take half, uh, half life damage. <clears throat> so you can do E, slow them down, and if they're slowed down enough, if they're close enough to you, there, then you can do your R, start the alt, and uh, catch them inside, and they die. Uh, <laughs> but the rest of the spells, uh, you can do Blood Boil on your ADC to go to boost the attack speed, or on the top laner to get down the turrets. Uh, you use Consume to farm the jungle, farm the jungle. You can do Dragon at level at level two easy with Nunu. You start red or it's blue and you go to the dragon and uh, at level 2 very easy. There you go. If you play against Nunu, you just step around from the alt, it's very easy. Avoid the alt. If you get Ice Blast, keep some distance with, uh, with Nunu until you're ready to kill him. Go around, kill his team and uh, that's it. Buy some magic resist if you must. Olaf, I know nothing about Olaf. Uh, I don't know how to play him. If you go against Olaf, uh, run away. Take turns into hitting him, because if you stay, if you, one of you stay close, stays close to him, he's gonna get you. Burst him down. Go around. You can buy a little armor, but buy some damage. Burst him down. He needs to chase you. Avoid the axe. Avoid the Q side to side. Run in a zigzag, and you're gonna be okay. Uh, Oriana. If you play Ariana, very fun champion. Uh, max Q, then uh, you can max Dissidence. If you play support, you can max Protect. Uh, max Protect. You can play mid with Q W R. Very very powerful champion. Does a lot of damage. It's a ball that does area of effect damage. If you play against Ariana, avoid the ball. Stay out of the ball because it's turn gonna turn into every year of effect damage with dissonance, the W or a shock wave. So stay away from the ball. Uh, burst her down. It's easy. Uh, in a team fight, she's dangerous. Uh, she's very dangerous in a team fight. Very dangerous. I saw a pentakill uh, yesterday. On a uh, diamond level uh, rank game, very powerful champion. Stay, you know, you have to, you have to, you have to catch the enemy one by one. You have to catch her team one by one because she can protect her team, her teammate, and use the ball to do shockwave. So give the ball some space. Try to catch her. She can, you can burst her down in two shots. So try to catch her in between some attacks. Good luck. Pantheon. I don't play Pantheon that much. If you buy, if he if he's fed, uh, he buys buy a thorn mail because it's about the only thing that's gonna save you. Um, Spear hurts. His combo is uh, jump. Yeah, 
his combo is a W. He's gonna jump on you, stun you. Not unlike the old LeBlanc, but hey, that's okay. They remove LeBlanc silence. I don't know. It's okay. So he jumps, stuns you, throws his spear. Then you're you're half dead, and then he's gonna throw a spear, and you're dead. So if you play against Pention, buy some armor. Uh, don't let him feed. If you're jungler, stop him somehow. I don't know, man. Uh, if you let him feed, he's gonna be very powerful. If you see the the alt is a big circle, it jumps in. Just step uh, step outside the circle. You have time. So and if you play Pention, get some attack damage. Your combo is jump. So it's W E Q jump strike spear shot and they're dead and you have to match with the uh, he has a shield um, after four spells he gets a shield so you have to crank your attack crank your shield before you attack and it's easy poppy poppy well it's a three hour video so i'm gonna i'm gonna snack in between Poppy is a special champion. Uh, the way you play against Poppy is um, you avoid her, go around, get the team, and then get her alone. If she chases you, you're in trouble. <laughs> buy some armor, buy some damage. If you see this cage on something, means that the only the only champion that can do damage to her is that one all the other champions she's impervious to all the other champions so what you want to do is you you want him to run away you want everybody to run away you want to kill the rest of the team while he's running away and when the alt is over then you jump on her hopefully the rest of the team is dead the rest of the enemies are dead so then you jump back on her. She's gonna lead the attack, so you wanna kite her, avoid her, make her miss her shots. She's gonna charge you, you just avoid her, flash away. If you try to fight her head on, you're gonna lose. Alright. Quinn. Quinn is the bird. Quinn will attack you, ba ba ba. Stay away. Stay away until you're ready to burst down. He's gonna chase you down. Be careful. You can buy a little bit of armor, even if you sell it later. Buy a cloth armor. Otherwise, he can burst you down really good. Um, he has a blind. He has a. Um, a vision uh, spell and he also his, his combo is gonna be uh, EQR tag team yeah so um, so you avoid him you can dash the, you can avoid I think you can avoid the vault if you uh, if you dash side to side Give him some room, but you have to poke him down. You have to burst him, then go away. Burst him again, go away. You can kill him. You have to kill him in two shots, in two separate attacks. If you try to ki to kill him in one shot, it's not gonna work. Ramus. If you play against Ramus, you want to uh, once he's rolling like this, you want to run away until he stops rolling. Because when he stops rolling, he does a ton of damage and stuns. He's got a defensive ball. You wanna s you wanna wait till that that's gone and before you attack. You have a puncturing taunt, which is a taunt which lasts only one second. So if you're taunted, don't go. Okay, well I'm gonna attack. Just give one or two auto attacks, or just one, and then start clicking away because the taunt is only one second, so it's not gonna last very long. If you see the tremors, the circle of, uh, of a result going on, run away, flash away, get away from there. Ramis is a powerful champion. Give him some space, wait till his cooldowns are, are on and then burst him down. 
Go around, kill his team. It's another kind of champion. He's a jungler. There we go. I'm going faster now because yeah, I go. Rek'Sai. Rek'Sai, very squishy champion, as far as I can tell. If you have uh, Rek'Sai in the enemy team, um, step on the. He's gonna. He's gonna make some holes in the ground. Step on them. He's got some tunnels. Destroy the tunnels. Put some wards in the in the river. Um, that's about it. That's about it. It's not very difficult. You just have to work as a team. That's the that's the impossible part. All right. Oh, I'm almost done. Okay, good. Whew, halfway done. Two hours. It's gonna be a four-hour video. Wow. Uh, Renekton. Renekton, 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 powerful champion, if you play him, build AD, have some fun, build some armor, build some life, he's gonna hurt like hell, if you play against Renekton, try to shut him down, use the jungler to shut him down, if you let him farm, he's gonna be too powerful, um, he has a stun, so you can buy a little bit of armor, buy some damage, get ready to burst him down, send him home, but once he's level 6, he has a powerful ult, you have to 2v1 him. Go around if you can, but it's very tough to go around. If you play against uh, Renekton, uh, what you have to watch for, you really need to stun him and burst him down and be able to get away. So if you don't have flash, don't even come close. 2v1 him, 3v1 him. If you can go around and kill his team, do that instead and finish keep him for last there's not much to do he's a very powerful champion if you see Renekton on the enemy it's gonna be a hard game be careful he's a very powerful champion it's not much there's not much to do against him all right Rengar Rengar very fun champ jumps around gets some kills assassin you want a max Q uh, Bola and or Battle Roar, Roar. and the uh, alt is just a boost of his attacks makes him invisible and, uh, and shit um, so you wanna build AD, you wanna jungle, you wanna build maybe a little bit of armor, a little bit of health if you see a Rengar in the enemy team uh, ward, wards, 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 pink wards at least at least a pink ward around you okay everybody should buy a pink ward all the time but especially with Rengar um, you can avoid the bola side to side if he jumps on you uh, flash away or, or stun him because uh, you're gonna get caught but it's tough to play Rengar you have to play as a team with Rengar so if the enemy team is just like five guys playing their own thing, Rengar is not gonna do much. Riven! Riven, I played a lot of Riven. Riven, Riven, max Q and shield. So Q is, so your combo is Q, Q. You can crank the Q, the Q is three steps. Just three step crank. And you saw an auto attack between each each Q. So he Q auto attack, Q auto attack, and then jump in the air, slam down, auto attack. Okay. There was six six bits of damage in there. So what you can do is you can flash, then use W, flash stun. That's a stun, you can flash stun if you want, or you can use a Q, or you can use the shield dash stun. So there's many possibilities with revenge, so you can go EW for stun, or flash e the flash W for the stun, or you can keep your stun to get away with the, with the E, you can do QQQ, stun, then get away with the E. And you can combo everything with starting with your alt. So you can do R, 
QQQ, blah blah blah, whatever, QWE, EWQ, uh...